Edinburgh's medical district could be getting a whole lot bigger. But before construction crews can break ground, taxpayers must approve it on the November ballot. Action Force Nadia Galindo explains. Well, today we spoke to several people living in the city of Edinburgh, and they say they plan on voting for the tax increase. Of course, not everyone is happy about paying more taxes, but the city of Edinburgh says it's in the best interest of the region. A new medical school, an expansion of the University of Texas Rio Grande Valley, are bringing a lot of changes to Hidalgo County. Valley counties are now pushing to create a hospital district that taxpayers must first approve. Travis County just uh, passed the measure uh, in a similar way because they're getting a new medical school. And if we look at where all the medical schools are located right now, there is a hospital uh, tax district that's in place. Edinburgh City Manager Ramiro Garza says it just makes sense to pass a tax. And the Edinburgh City Council agrees. They passed a resolution in support of the new taxing district this week. We are really trying to push uh, the passage of it because we really feel it's going to change uh, the dynamics of our region, our economy uh, with the new medical school. The taxing district would help create the UTRGV Medical School. Garza says the funds will also help absorb the cost of indigent care, which the county currently pays for with money from the county's general fund. Homeowners will be footing the tax. It'll be eight cents per $100 of value on a home. So for a home valued at $100,000, that's $80 of tax per year. The money is going to have to come off from somewhere in order for us to build, you know, new studies, new buildings, new universities. So for me, it's, it's, it's a good idea. Taxpayer Jose Morales tells us there are many benefits in creating a hospital district, more doctors in the region, and more research on diseases like diabetes, which both of his parents recently died from. And this item will be on your ballot if you're an Hidalgo County resident on November 4th. In the Hidalgo County Newsroom, Nadia Galindo, Action 4 News. If the tax is approved in November, homeowners will not be taxed until January of 2016.